Okay, back, and now you fixed the problem. I also know why it happened this time. So, there's a setting in YouTube which is 360 degree video. I guess it gets turned on sometimes. I have no idea, like, what makes it get turned on. I never did anything to turn it on. This is the, it happened to me a bunch of times already. Let me start the Twitch stream, too. This is the first time I actually figured out why. So, theoretically, next time it happens, I would have to shut everything down and, re and redo it. But, like, I don't know why the... F first of all, who would want that? What kind of a crappy feature is that? Anyway, hey, Gamer's Grotto. Hey, Pirate Gamer Boy. Um... <laughs> I, don't, I kind of like stretch-headed stew. Well, sorry about that. All right. So, the game we have here today is called Ice Hockey. Here is the box. Um, this is one of the uh, the Activision sports titles. So, like, you know, Atari had, like, you know, football, baseball, you know, soccer, boxing, all these different things, basketball. Uh, they didn't have ice hockey. So, Activision made ice hockey. Interesting, on the bottom it says here, um, for use of the Atari video game system, they like very small letters. Atari Inc. is not related to Activision Inc. Like they had, they had to tell you that because Activision, as you know, was the first third-party um, game developer. Hey, Mark, how's it going? Mark says, good evening, Stu. Um, so this game was designed by Alan Miller, um, one of the four you know guys who left Atari to form Activision. And um, I will... Rather than like looking at that, I'll I'll show you the instructions quickly, and then we'll get started. So here's the card, obviously. Um, I'm not it's not connected at the moment because I just you know dumped the ROM and I'm using it on the Stella emulator. And then here's the instructions, and it's pretty complex, um, sort of. There's four different games right now. It's one on the screen, so it's game one, and I'm gonna play game one. Basically, the four games, two of them are against the computer, two of them are against you know two players against a friend. The game one's is regular action. Game three is high speed action, which I'm not sure which difference is. But um, I want to join the Activision All Star Hockey Team, and it says um, if you beat if you beat the computer on game one, then you can join the All Star Hockey Team. So that's my that's my goal. Um, Mark says I read a raving review about this game on VideoGameCritic.com. They're often pretty harsh. So we should see this one. I never played this back in the day. Actually, I played the Nintendo Ice Hockey, which I loved. This game is also pretty cool. Um, the AVG ended their Atari Sports video, which is very funny. He didn't have too much to say about this one, except for the fact that if you look, you can see even the picture right now, only the two guys closest to the puck have sticks. Obviously, there's only two guys on the, t on the, t on the field from each on the, on the, on the ice, I guess, from each team. And then they pass the sticks back and forth to each other. There's a little bit, it takes some getting used to. You can only control one person at a time. Gamers Grotto wants to know why they're zooming around with rainbows attached to butt their, their butts on the cover. And as you probably know, Gamers Grotto, this was the Activision um, marketing style for all their boxes. They always had these rainbow art around the people, and it, it gave like a, a uniformity to the design of all their boxes, which is which is super cool, actually. The only thing that they used to do is give credit to the designers. So here it actually says, you know, Alan Miller himself wrote, a, wrote, a, wrote some tips and tricks for the game. But basically... Um, I, I, you can read it, but like it's it's sort of confusing. I, I haven't really figured this out honestly. Um, the game only lasts like three minutes. I'm using a Atari joystick. I feel like a lot of the challenge here is like not letting your hand get tired <laughs> for three minutes. But I I haven't played beaten the computer yet. I haven't tried too hard. Um, Gamers Grog says swear all the rainbows back then. It's like. All developers of gamers are stoners. No, I don't think that's what it is. Pirate Gear was. I think all my Activision cards is a little bit of that label mold. It's just the it's just the glue. Um, it's just the glue, sort of like um, get, like getting the back of the uh, of the paper like wet or something. It's it's just the glue coming through. It's not it's not label mold. All right, let's start this off here. So I think F two starts it. So three minutes. He already got the puck. Wait, he scored on me already. I'm going to start over. Like, it's hard to control this thing. Like, uh, just to see how it works. I move the guy. Now I have the puck. And now, now, like, I have an easy shot on goal. So sometimes it's like you get the puck and it's super easy. Other times they get the puck and it seems like it's super easy for them. I haven't really figured out how to stop them when they get the puck. And also they... Like, that time I got him for a second. But not for very long. Hey, Hopster Key, how's it going? Good to see you, man. All right, I'm going to restart this. I want to have a better chance. Okay, here we go. So this time I got the puck, sort of. He knocked that guy, knocked me over. My goalie, some, oh come on, what, what are my goalie? See, 
I didn't mean that to happen. You see that the goalie like ran all the way out. I was trying to control the guy at the front, but somehow my goalie ran really far out. Hopster Key says, I finally, I'm, 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 this game I'm abandoning also. Finally got Simpsons Arcade on C64. Awesome. I have it on DOS. I've never played the C64 one. And Marx looks like activate you the rainbows to convey emotion. Okay, here, I'm going to start it now for real. Here we go. It helps when I get the first puck, right? But you see, the, the puck just goes in a random direction at the face-off. I've tried to, like, hit the thing. That time I actually got it. Oh. Oh, come on. See, he knocked me over. The problem is, if I try to knock them over, usually they just go past me and they score. Oh, jeez. See, look what's up with that. If I try to if I try to use the, st the, the stick on them, I usually fail. So, like, they are pretty good, actually. Oh, man, that's, that was my fault. Oh, no! If they get past you, you're dead, basically. Okay, see, they, they get the face off, like, almost every time, too. Ooh. That time he just screwed it up. But he knocked me over again. Damn it. I suck. I passed it right to him, too. The passing... The, where, the, where the puck goes is controlled completely by the angle of the, the, the... Where the ball is on the stick. Where the puck is on the stick, rather. Not the ball. Whoa! I did something right, I think. See, that's how I tried to swing the puck through the, my stick, and I just got knocked over. And that's how you just walked around me. <laughs> so it's not so easy. Even when I get the puck in the beginning, I usually screw it up. That's why I just pass it right back to him. And he went around me and screwed it. God damn it. Alright, I need some practice here. I really want to beat this guy's ass. Yay! Ah! Come on! I suck. <laughs> no! <laughs> I like this. I suck big time. I pass right back to that. Oh, but see, my goalies are running out of the goal. It's not good. I'm not trying to do that, but you can only you control the both at the same time. A lot of times, you'll do things you don't want to do. It's like that. Damn. And he knocked me over again. Oh, come on. My, my hand gets so tired after some time. The referee in this hockey match needs to get fired. He's able to knock me over with impunity. I need to figure out how to do that. That's where I'm screwed up. Oh, come on. He's blocking me. All right, this is not going to be the winning game, obviously, but we'll, we'll, we'll learn a lesson from this. There we go. Oh, I knocked him over by accident. Oh, yeah, this, this this joystick sucks. By the way, like I'm not I'm not used to the Atari joystick. It's so stiff. I really would like to beat the computer, but I don't think it's gonna happen. Get up, get up, get off your ass! Oh my god, my goalie was on the floor the whole time. Less realistic than NES. That's for sure. <laughs> oh man, it hurts to play this game. I just suck at it, that's the problem. I, I, I need to get better. I have to figure out how to stop him when he comes to, against my goalie, and that's what I can't figure out. Oh, I plays a different. See, look, look what I do here. Okay, that time he just threw it away. The time ran out, okay. 14 to 7. So he got twice as many goals as I did. Ah, oh, man, that's what you guys are saying. Um, I joke a lot. The referee the time should be fired. Let's just say yes, ice hockey. Then it doesn't cut. There's only also two players. Ah, oh, man. All right, I gotta try this again. I really want to be able to beat the computer because, like it says here, if you beat the computer, 
you will discover our Activision computers and a lot of practice. I gotta put the fan on. This. I, mean, <laughs> I play this game. There's a lot of practice skating and scoring goals. So if you beat on game one, send us a letter and tell us the score. Make sure a friend is watching as you outplay your opponent. So he or she can sign the letter as a witness to your achievement. We'll then send you an official All Star emblem. So I mean, what are you guys gonna be a witness if I can actually beat this game? Which I, I don't know if that's gonna happen. All right, I gotta I gotta learn, learn the strategy here. Yeah, this thing is stiff. All right, here we go. First blood goes to Stu. Second, third, and tenth blood goes to this guy. <laughs> How do you stop him? When I try to drive past him, he just always takes the puck. The puck, like there. The only success I've ever had is by like just. Getting in his face, and sometimes sometimes I can block him. But see, right now, he just walked right past me. <sighs> and I can't even get there. The other guy's just standing there like a putz. Alright, good. Can I stop right now? Oh, damn. Actually got the ball. Oh! Get back there! Damn! Damn you! I can't really move up. I, I guess I'm moving up. That's part of the problem. I'm moving up too much as the goalie. Whew. He still got right past me there. If I get the puck in the beginning, usually I can I can score, but not always. See, I, if I try to just... Damn, 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 damn. I wasted that opportunity. Yeah, I knocked him over. Finally, I did something right. <laughs> yeah. Damn you. Bastard, get up! <laughs> no! No! Come on! No! 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 no, no. I almost had it! Ah, oh, I lost now. I'm right out of time. Damn it. I was close! Damn! Damn! <laughs> what are you guys saying? Gears Gross, I really tired of joystick. I got too much better than it last time. I Last time was 14 to 7. Gamers Gross, I'm really Atari joysticks. My friend, when I was a kid, played kind of like some kind of hand torture. Mind you, the Tandy 1000 joysticks were much better. Mark says, yeah, my house was a bunch of third-party joysticks. I feel like if I don't use, use the real joystick, like, it's like I'm not be, I'm cheating somehow. Uh, 
Hoy's asleep. Come on, I got a lot of money running on this game. That's funny. <laughs> All right, we'll try. I hope you're. I hope you're. You're betting on the other team. That would've been smart. I'm gonna try it again. You know, that's like that three minutes feels like an eternity. <laughs> it's like the longest three minutes of any, of my entire life. Honestly, oh my god. Oh my goodness. Ugh, my hand. All right, here we go. How did, he, how did he stop that? I think I'm getting a little bit better. Just a little bit. No, no, no. Not a lot better. Just a little bit better. Yeah. Hard fought battle. Yeah! How come the puck always goes in his direction? Damn, how come the puck always goes in his direction? You see that? What the fuck is he doing? I can't control the puck at all. Mm, mm, mm. No, he knocked me over. Oh, damn, get up, get up, get up. Damn it! I want to pause the game. It's like my head is killing me. If I could pause, it would help. Get up! Why are you all bat way back there? Get up, you fool! Get up to the net. How did he even get that in there? Why does it go in every time? Am I supposed to just make on the face off? Hold on a second. All right, that time I pressed the button. May I supposed to do something? May I? May I not do something on the face off that I'm supposed to be doing? Oh my god, I wish I could go for both these assholes to move at the same time. <sighs> that time I just passed it right to him. Get back, get back. Damn. Oh, come on! How do you get past me? My, my, my players fucking suck. I'm sorry. Every single goddamn time. I had enough of this. F you, bastard. Hey, that was dumb, but actually, it wasn't that dumb. No! Oh, come on! How did that miss? Oh, come on. I'm actually playing a game here. Uh, too bad I already like, blew the game. Knocked him over. Oh, come on. Seriously? <laughs> Alright, time is up. But, but that was a valiant effort. That was a valiant effort. That was a valiant effort. <sighs> okay. Am I supposed to take some option during the face-off? I don't know. I'm not sure. Not controlling the puck, you're rather screwed. Still, you can pause. Yeah, that'd be cheating. That would be cheating. Play some Pong instead or Video Olympics. I could do that, but that I'm getting better at this. You notice that? I am getting better. Just the question is, will I beat the computer before or after my hand falls off? That's the only question. Last game was 12 to 7 or something. I said I only got 5, but they also only got 8. So I'm doing something right, I think. 
Alright, here we go. We're going to try again. That was good. I'd be more aggressive. Ah, uh, damn. All right, that didn't work. That's cheap. When I hit right back to the stick. The other one, same thing. No! Oh! Whoa, how'd that happen? Oh, come on. <laughs> Damn. I gotta stop them from getting these easy goals. That's where they're killing me. When they get those easy goals on me, like they almost just did now, I'm not sure how they didn't. Get back there. Move, 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 move. Not that way. Move! Move! Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Ha! <laughs> I don't get a lucky goal like that. It's the second time, though. Damn. No. Yes. <laughs> Do that again. No, 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 no. Go. No. No. <laughs> yes. Oh, come on! No, 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 no! Damn. Oh, fucked it up. God damn it, I was doing so well! <laughs> I was doing so well. <laughs> what are you guys saying here? <laughs> Seven to eight. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> Always a sleep says you stay till you win a game, sir. I agree with that. Pirate game one. You ever played original Sims Day Warriors or emulation the original media? Um. I mean, for the most part, emulation with the original media. I mean, I play on PCs, but you know, so even if it's a PC game, usually it's, it's DOS box or something. But I do play. I have I have PS4 sitting over here. Um, I have a Wii sitting over here, and I do play newer games on Windows on this thing too. We're too old for games and controls and inflict hand pain, says Mark. I agree. Um, <laughs> Cameras cross. That sounds like torture. Hey, Dorian Care. Didn't realize ice hockey only four players. Neither did I, but apparently it does. Arena Foot is trolling me. Um, that's an improvement. You know, I hold most of the world records for this time. But you can give me some tips. I never played this before. 
This is bringing haunted Halloween 85 levels of stress. Uh, Arena Foot, I'm trying. I'm trying my best here. Like, I never played this before, but I the first game I got I got beaten, like, I don't know, 16 to... Was it 14 to 7? This time it's only 8 to 7, so... <laughs> I guess I'm getting better, I think. But yeah, I haven't quite figured out how to do it. Play Game 3. Why Game 3? I want to play Game 1 because it says the instructions, and if I play Game 1, then um, I can send away for a official all-star emblem if I win. That's my goal here, is to win against the computer, which I just... I mean, I gave... I, 8 to 7, if it was 7 to 8, if it was 8 to 7 instead of 7 to 8, then I would have been eligible for an all-star emblem, which is, like, my, my main goal here. If I play Game 3 and I win, I don't get nothing. That's the problem. But Arena Foot, maybe you can give me some tips, aside from playing Game 3, a tip on Game 1. All I know is my hands are killing me. Oh my gosh. I never had this game back in the day. It's my own fault. Ice hockey. Yeah, you see it says here, Game 1 is the one I'm playing now. You versus the Activision computer. At face-off, the puck slides towards you. Just hit the fire button. I did that before. I got two scores in this past game. By doing that, it was like lucky. It bounced off the wall and it went in. Um, is there any way to make the puck slide towards you? Because it seems like it slides towards them most of the time. Is there a cheat for this to make the opponent's AI gamer? All right, I'm gonna play a game of Arena Foot. You can watch me, and therefore you can be tell me what I'm doing wrong. You can, you can diagnose my excuse my performance. Tell me what I'm doing wrong. Yeah, you got to get the Activision patch, Pirate Game Boy. I'm totally with you. All right, so let's try it again. Oh, I'm not even focusing. There we go. See, that time I just missed it completely. So, okay, I'm, I'm restarting the game. But, like, my guy got stuck. But what, what happened there? See, I, I just suck at this. I guess I gotta be more aggressive with, with these guys. Need to play better defense the top player. Wait, what does it say? Need to keep at the top, let the puck move, not the player? What do you mean? Let the puck move, not move the player. What am I? What am I supposed to do with him? I, that's what, that's you're right. That's my biggest problem is I can't figure out what to do with that guy. This is this doesn't even count. This I'm just I'm just like talking to you. Like when I'm up there, what I've been doing is like sort of just keep me all the way at the top, try to try to match this guy and like and then hit the button. Here, I don't want to take have it. You take it. That's what I've been doing, like hitting the ball basically. That's what I've been trying to do at least. And then missing it like that. Let me start over, though. Here we go. See that? No, if they see, I didn't mean for that to happen. He got in front of me. The, the, the problem is, like, when you move the bottom player, the top player sometimes moves also. Goalie pass the pluck to the lower player. Look at this. He's just playing. He's just trolling me. Look at this. Why? Why do you do that? Why? Why did he like put it in? I don't know. He still scored on me. All right, let's start over here. See, I, I, okay, you said just press the thing. Let me try it again. Hold on. I'm going to try what you said. See, that didn't work. It almost worked. How do I stop him from scoring? See, I'm trying to be too greedy with this guy. He knocked me over. See, that's not... I'm, I'm, I, I had a few good lucky shots the first time, but not this time. I forgot, that guy can't even go up there, even if he wanted to. Do not move your player. Why not? Do not move which player? Any of my players? Oh, I see. The, don't move my player face off.
I just did what you said. It didn't work. Just FYI, I tried just to just to move it. Oh, he knocked my guy over. <laughs> they're, they're, I think their AI became more adept or something. He still scored on me. to hit him. Oh, damn. Why is it why does the puck go towards him like 90% of the time? That's what I don't understand also. There we go. Ah, he blocked it. You see, it doesn't always work. Damn. That time he... He wasn't going towards me. Get up! Get up! Actually winning. This is the first time I, 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 I've come close to, to having the lead. Yes! I'm getting better. Ah, oh, man. Come on, time run out. No! No! Come on! What the? F How did that happen? <sighs> goalie keeps coming down. Keep going. See, the goalie comes down sometimes when I don't want him to because he moves when the other guy moves. Do not move your player. Okay, okay. pass the puck. Do not go through the goalie like that. Now you're catching up, but I still lost. Mark, have a good night. I'm going to beat this goddamn... Yeah, I'm going to beat this stupid piece of crap. Sorry. I know it's a good game, but I'm just getting frustrated. Oh, by the way, if you like seeing me yell at the game, please subscribe to the channel. <laughs> and like. All right, here we go. Why can't they knock him down? Yes! No! I was cheap. How come I can never knock this guy over? He's always knocking me over. That, that's how I knocked him over. Come on, how do you do that? That was also cheap. All right, I can't do that. I can't leave the goal. That, like that's what he's trying to tell me. Leaving the goal is a mistake every time. Oh, come on! All right, I deserve to lose. I'm starting this game over. Wait, hold on. What are you saying? Seriously, you give yourself a heart attack. You keep thinking games is brutal. Like, probably. With the goal of the AI player in front of your goal top, don't hold down the button. You manage to catch this puck with the stick and swiping at it. That's what I was trying before, but it, seemed like, it didn't seem like it was working. 
Let me try. Let me try this one more time now. All right, here we go. There we go. That actually worked. I got it now. Okay. I like these tips. Nice. Once I got it, I just I hit it back to him, but that didn't help me at the end. I gotta get it away from him and pass it down court. There we go. There we go. Oh, he blocked it. Yeah. Yeah! That was best, my mistake. I'm getting the hang of it though. Oh, come on. And up, move, move your ass, come on. Oh, so you took it away from me that time. See, my goalie ran up and I didn't want him to. Oh, my goodness. Ah! Get back in front of the goal! Oh, come on. Can't knock that guy over. This is like six unanswered points. And he blocked that one again. No! <laughs> Get back. Don't run up, goalie. I really blew it here, didn't I? Move, 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 move. Oh my god. Move. Move. Read that patch. We're not getting it this time, I don't think. Is there sudden death overtime in this game? Look how he's toying with me. No, nope, not happening. <laughs> I should have. I mean, like, how is that possible that I that I screwed up so badly? <laughs> I like bouncing the puck into a dead corner and rolling right out to get it. Yeah, there you go, four zero. But like, oh man, how did I blow it so badly? Were you saying that till I got here? No, it ends in the oh, it ends in the tie. Okay, well, I need to beat him. All right. Well, I'm, 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 I'm definitely getting better. So. Alright, let's try this again. See, that's how they stopped it. You see that? They don't always. They, they sometimes he stops that. And that time he got through my stick, too. That was bad. I hit it off the wall and just went right back to him. That was even worse, because I had it and I didn't use it. Yeah. Ah, 
Damn. How did I not do that? Not shoot with the guys right there. Damn. I gotta remember some of these mechanics. I keep doing the same stupid thing over and over again. That's part of the problem here. See, when I try to do that, I fall on my ass. When he tries to do it, he just goes right through me. Move. Why is my... What? See, I wish... Part of the problem with this game is you can't decide who you're controlling. If the computer... Like, Activision decides for you who you're controlling, and it's not the guy that I want to control. I'm getting really frustrated. Oh, come on. That was... The computer gave me, a, like, a freebie there. Get up. Oh, man, again, I did the same stupid thing. Stop doing that, Stu. I need to hit the puck. I don't know what happened there. Goalie? <laughs> no! You suck, goalie! Piece of fucking shit! Why do they do that? Why don't they, like... Why, why does the goalie stand there in the corner? Because I try to move the other guy. Based on where the puck is, which way you control. The puck is in your stick's direction to look... Yeah, I'm aware of that, but it's really hard to get to, to, to angle it properly. <sighs> Arena Foot, I wish I could actually have you as a guest right now. To, like, just... <laughs> wow, you good to last minute, <laughs> thanks. I wish you could... Probably just my hand gets tired. I wish you could come on the channel right now as a guest to show us how it's done. Because I'm sure you do much better than me. I'm not done yet. I'm, 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 oh, I'm with always asleep. It's like we're gonna keep playing this thing until we win. I want to get that patch. <laughs> I want to get that goddamn patch. If my head falls off and I can't play any more games after this, then that's it. You know, like. All right, here we go. I gotta figure out how to deal with that with this guy properly. I feel like everything I do is just like a stopgap. I don't have the real solution.
That was another mistake. That was definitely not good. Ah, damn. He just took it right out of my hands. No, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Get up! I start playing off better than I, than I finish every time. You notice that? See, sometimes I'm also not used to the, the angles of the shooting yet. If I, if I was better with that, then I'd be better with the whole game. You jazz, I can't see what you're saying right now. You gotta hang on. Piece of crap! Get up! Get up! Ah, oh, that was such a good rally, and I cocked it up. God, what are you guys saying here? Wait, is this the hockey? <laughs> Huge jazz. I don't know. You can your mouth fall off, kind of annoying. You, you mad? I'm mad. Arena Foot says, plus a years of experience in this title. A profile back in 2014 with several ice hockey virtual trophies on there. You, know, you start good, you just keep away from the AI. Yo, sh shut the Look at what you're you, Huge Jazz. My, 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 my jazz is pretty huge, too. Bounce with the puck of the world skate that kills time. He was the problem. Nothing. Okay, we chill. Thank you, Gamers Grotto. This is the hockey. I watched the hockey the other day. It didn't look like this. I'm muted? I'm not muted. Let's say I'm muted. Um, Huge as I, I like new newcomers to the channel, but if you're gonna like troll, then we're gonna have to kick you out. Does anybody else think I'm muted or is it just Mr. Mr. Huge Ass? Pirate Gear Boy 12 says the winner is you. Arena Foot says win. Thank you, Dorian Cairn. Activision Ice Hockey. Yeah, this is, so, I mean, he jazz. I would explain this to you if you wanted to know, but I get the feeling you don't want to know. You're just being a dick. So, if you want to be a nice guy, feel free to stay here. If you want to be a dick, you could be a dick somewhere else. <laughs> oh, sorry, my bad. <laughs> well, the good thing is, I already bought the patch off eBay, so now, now I actually earned it. Now I actually can, can, can wear it. All-Star Hockey Team. I'll put this proudly on my t-shirt. And I can, uh, you know, for the rest of my life say that I finally beat the computer in a score of 8-7, to seven, just barely by the skin of my pants. <laughs> Alright, huge as we forgive you. Oh boy, that took a lot out of me. That was really hard. I mean, I, I'm tempted to play it again now, and... Um, See if I could do better, 
I'm sure I could with enough practice, but my hand also kills. <laughs> oh my goodness. Stu, is this a nickname or am I kidding? All right, Hugh Jazz, I think it's time for you to go because you're not being a very nice person. And, you know, we're not making fun of your huge ass, but, uh, you know, yeah, Gamer's Grotto, I think it's time for him to leave. You know what? I, I, I really appreciate this. Huge ass, I really appreciate you. If he wants to stay, we'll give him one more chance. I really appreciate you, huge ass, because now I know that I actually am, I'm, I'm a real YouTuber, because I got a troll on my channel. There's a, there's a, there's a, there's a, a troller and a, and a spammer. And you know what? I'm willing to give you another chance just because you made me so happy that I actually arrived as a YouTube streamer. You'd like to apologize. <laughs> Alright, Gamer's Ground time to out for 300 seconds. During, I, but still, I, I just want to say, you know, I'm honored that I've been trolled. I mean, it's and, and, you know, like seriously, it warms the cockles of my heart. And now that my heart has this, this ice hockey, all-star hockey team patch on it, you know, that's even a better accomplishment. <laughs> but Gamer's Ground, thanks for putting me in a timeout. Cram it, Hugh. Oh, we got another guy, the Bubs. Hey, the Bubs, how's it going? You're new? <laughs> are, you, are you related to Hugh Jazz by any chance? Just curious. I'm, Dorian Cairns, this is literally the first time I've watched an ice hockey match in my life. Hope you're proud. I am proud, and I'm proud of myself for, for winning this patch fair and square. Um... Yeah, there were a bunch of trolls before before the bubs, um, but uh, I mean I I can play again now, but I'm I'm sure I'll lose, <laughs> and then I'll have to do it again until I win. I'd rather like retire, like not retire, not never play this game again, obviously. But I'd rather just, I feel like I want to just end this session here with the win, the first win. How many games did I play? Like ten games. This is the first win I actually got. And again, it doesn't say in the, in the manual here, and it's just to be fair, you know, it doesn't say in the manual that you need to beat the, beat the computer like 50 times. It just says, uh, if you can read it, it says, send us a letter. If you beat him on game one, send, send us a letter and tell us the score. So that's what I did. I guess maybe they might tell you, maybe, maybe if I sent the letter back in the day, try game three. All right, fine, I'll try game three. That's fair. Now that, now that I earned my patch, I will try game three. Um. Here we go. What happened? Some some guy named Huge Ass came in here and was and was talking a lot, but don't worry about it. The bubs. It's okay. If you, we're not we're not like doing anything to you. All right. Let's let's put on, let's put on game three. How do I do that? Game two. Game three. I never tried game three before at all. So, let's see what happens now. It says it's supposed to be high speed. Oh, wait, that's the wrong button. Here we go. Timer doesn't seem like it's high speed though. How's this high speed? It seems like the same exact speed as before. Oh, it bounced off the wall a little bit harder. Oh, it's bouncing more. That's cool. I like that. The puck moves. <laughs> Is that what you're talking about? Game three, slick ice. Ah, I see. The puck is definitely bouncing more. He knocked me over and I still scored. Oh, so it goes much faster. Oh, I see. That's actually cool. No, oh, no, get back there. Oh, come on! That was cheap. So now I can rick ricochet off the corners like much more effectively, theoretically, if I learn what I'm doing. Get up. Come on. I think I just knocked it in myself. Oh no. Wow, he really fielded it pretty well there. That was impressive. I'm not used to this slick ice yet. That wasn't good.
Oh, come on. That was cheap. That was cheap too, so that's okay. It's really hard to knock the guy over, I noticed. Yeah! <laughs> the goalie scored. Actually, this, this mode, that's what you should be doing, just bouncing off the walls, I hope it goes in. Oh man, that was my fault. Uh, that was also my fault, I should have gotten that. <laughs> I scored against myself. Uh, you, gotta get the, you gotta get the hang of this, but I do like this game 3, it's actually pretty cool. I just, I just gotta like figure out what I'm doing. Can't run past the guy like that. Ah oh, man. Wake up, little Susie, wake up. Ah oh, man. He got me there. Ah oh, man. I really like this mode. Actually. Ah, that was cheap. Arena foot. This is a good call. I lost. I'm not gonna try it again. That was a lot of fun, actually. He was close to racial terms. I didn't see any racial terms. Yeah, he, he got he got timed out for a reason because he was be, he was being annoying. But I, but I don't I didn't see him say any racial terms. I, if he did, I missed it. It was, you didn't say hi and they banned you either, though, huge ass. I think you're exaggerating a little bit now. I think it's more like you talked like 5,000 times a second and then he timed you out. So take a chill and make sure, use your words. And if you want to say something, make sure it's something interesting. Arena Foot says, I love Game 3. Me too. It's like, the, the game, the game 3 is more fun than Game 1, I think. I just was playing Game 1 because I wanted the patch. Now that I got the patch, let's try Game 2 Game 3 again. You gotta like play the corners like in you gotta be much more strategic about it. Uh, I don't know how, how come he got up so goddamn fast when he fell down, and when I fall down it takes me like twenty years to get back up. What's up with that? I gotta figure that out too. Get out of my way. There you go. That's how you do it. You gotta play the corner, play the play the boards. The, the, fa the fact that they can't chase you all the way down the ice is a is a big disadvantage for them, actually. Oh no, not my fault. Man, get up, get up! How do you, what are you supposed to do to get up? You supposed to press button or something? Oh come on! What? What? Is, how does? The biggest problem with this game, by the way, is the fact that that one control controls both of your guys. I know a lot of sports games are like that, but it's really hard sometimes to control the right person. Do 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 bad to the bone. I don't even know who's, what you're referring to. Always asleep, but that's a good song. Bad do 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 
Yeah, I forgot about your trick. It's okay. Uh oh. Like my goalie was like sitting on his ass and I couldn't move him. I think they have to make up their mind. Either you control both of them or you control neither one of them. It takes too long to get the control back to the to their player. Once you like once you already pa once you pass to my guy, I should automatically get the control back to the other player. Once there's no way for me to do it to do anything against me. I would win this game. Why well, I want to win this game? Stop screwing it up, Stu. Yeah. No. No, 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 I blew it. That was a great shot! Finally, this thing good. And that's something like bad. I'm gonna win! There's only six seconds left! You can't beat me! Ha ha ha! I'm gonna win! I'm gonna win! I'm gonna win! Yes! <laughs> Woohoo! Don Draper says what? What does Don Draper say? That was that you gotta use those bank shots. I agree. That's that's what I was doing here. All right, I want to see what you guys are seeing here. Uh, hold on. Well, wow, a lot of talking. Shu Jass is talking a lot. Okay. So you rude insulting. <laughs> Dorian Karen says, A guy with the name Hugh Jass is a reputation that can be ruined. <laughs> That's funny. By the way, guys, if you're new, you can, you can subscribe if you want, even if you're being annoying. And hit like, too. I... Uh, Insulting your tie down, not bad. Turns out how aggressive the hit is, how fast the recovery is. That's interesting. You didn't ask my question what kind of music you listen to. I didn't even hear your question, the bubs. I listen to lots of stuff, but I like classic rock probably the best. Um, if you're a band, you wouldn't be back in here. Duh, duh, duh. Oh, that's the, this is the bad to the bone. Oh, he said hack the bone. I, was, I thought he said the bad to the bone. I. Uh, what else? Uh, once you figure out the face-off, you'll increase your score easily. Okay, that's help. That's helpful. Uh, who died? I made mean, you king of the chat. Gamers Grotto. Well, I guess I did because he because he's a moderator. Um, if you got if you behave yourself, you can become a moderator too. But it's it's unlikely. Arena Foots is a winner. Yeah. Yes. Exactly. Um. Dorian Cairns says, Stu, I'm still not clear what your stream schedule is. My stream schedule is typically Thursday nights, Saturday nights, and Sunday nights, although this past Thursday I fell asleep and missed it. And usually I stream around 10 p.m. Eastern, but today I was at a wedding, so I started late. And I'm probably also going to stream this week a few extra streams because it's Thanksgiving. Um, so um, I'm not sure exactly what my next stream will be. It probably will be... Wednesday maybe this week because Thursday I'm off so I might do a Wednesday night stream if people are gonna be around and instead of Thursday maybe um Hugh Jazz says wait but you're alive I said who died well it was a bad question Hugh Jazz you should have said uh um you know who made you who made you king around here Don Jamer says what do you should play Atari I play Atari a lot so what I what I've been doing lately my schedule and this is I guess back to my schedule I've been alternating between three different things. One is Atari 2600 games. Two is TRS-80 games, which is a classic PC, which came out the same year as Atari, 1977. Um, they're also pretty primitive, but they're they're pretty cool, and they, they get no attention at all. If you talk about hidden gems, I don't know about gems, but they're definitely hidden. <laughs> um, I play lots of a 2600 home bruise arena foot. Um, I don't know if you're aware of that, but I, 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 I actually need to come back to some of them so, so wait, let me finish what I was saying. I switch, I switch off to the Atari 2600 
Tiras 80, and did Adventure Games of All Stripes. So Adventure, I was I was playing this uh, the other day, three and three, which is a, which is an adventure puzzle game. So I alternate between those three things. Um, at Arena Foot, I played a bunch of homebrews, um, and I, I need to go back to them and try to finish some of them, because Circus Convoy, it's not like a homebrew, I guess, but Circus Convoy I played a couple times. I love it. It's a lot of fun, but it's hard, and I'm tr trying to figure out what to do. So I got, I think I got more than half, like probably three quarters of the way through it, but I haven't beaten it yet. I played Dragon's Descent recently, which is very, very hard. I've also played Ninja Sky in Low Res World, which is amazing, and I, I beat it one time off stream, and I haven't yet beat it on stream. I need to come to that also, come back to that. And I played another game by the same guy called The Roach in Space or something like that, um, which is also pretty hard, just like Dragon's Descent. Those are some of the homebrews I played recently. So I, I do play I do definitely plan to play more homebrews. Um, I have Princess Rescue somewhere around here somewhere. Um, and actually just bought an Atari Flashback 2, because I don't know if you guys saw the news around Atari is, is going to be selling um, cartridges again, and they're re-releasing like some of these games that came out of the Flashback too, like Aqua Venture and um, Yars Return, and uh, what's the last one? Uh, Saboteur that Howard, Howard Scott Warshaw did. I actually have a card of Saboteur from Atari Age, but I, f I figured let me actually um, oh yeah I, I figured let me actually buy a Flashback too. I just got it over here. Brand new, um, except the, there's a little sun fading on the cover, unfortunately, on the front cover. The back cover is fine. And I what I plan to do in, a, in an upcoming video is, is I do like an unboxing of it, even though it's old. And then I'm going to play a bunch of the games, a bunch of the homebrews off of the off of the flashbacks. I figured that would be cool. Um, this is your second stream, Marina Foot. I didn't know that. you guys, you got to come more often. And Tube was a lot of fun, I remember. But yeah, I played a lot of homebrews before that. Um, actually, more I played Journey Escape. That was the last Atari game I played before Ice Hockey, was Journey Escape. So I don't play them in any particular order. It's just basically I pull something off my shelf, and I'm like, oh, this looks good. Let's play that one. That's how I typically do it. Dorian Karen says, uh, Atari still pretend there's still a video game company. It seems like it, but the, the it's a, it looks like it's a big ripoff from what I can tell. They're charging like 50 bucks just for a cartridge. And then $150 for a box. And meanwhile, you can get, like, Saboteur off Atari Age for 50 bucks, like, all in with a, with a box. So I have a feeling they're going to tell Atari Age to, like, stop doing it, which is real bullshit because they, that's, like, the fair price for the game. So I don't know what the deal is. And then uh, is Yars Return any good? I, I haven't played it yet. I've heard that it's not that great, but I don't know. Howard Scott Warshaw apparently had nothing to do with it, but I want to try it and play it. I agree, Yars Revenge is, is a great game, so uh, I want to I want to try it out. But anyway, yeah, I got a whole ton of stuff to to, to play, um, including like stuff sitting around. What's 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 the next one on my shelf probably going to be? Oh yeah, I wanted to play I wanted to play uh, either Crazy Castles, Chris, not Crazy Castle, Chris, not. Chris, that's the thing of the NES game. Crystal Castles or Canyon Bomber. Those are the two I'm looking at right now. Canyon Bomber is like a, a, a game that nobody plays, but it's made by David Crane, so I figured it can't be that bad. I want to try that out. Uh, Howard Scott Warshaw. What is the second part of that? Dodge Aperson what says, says what says. <laughs> Howard Scott Warshaw washes... I don't know. <laughs> Arena Foot, yeah, 50 cart... Well, it doesn't. It, it's not clear if it's if there's a box in there or not. It's not clear at all. It might be a box, and even if it is, like, for, why is it done on the manual? And then for one fifty, you get like a bunch of random crap. Like, who needs a poster and a lapel pin? Why am I going to pay hundred hundred dollars extra for that? Oh, that's the Easter egg from Yars Revenge. Ah, uh, thank you, thank you very much. I forgot about that. Can't wait for the new Congo Bongo homebrew. So, I, see, that one thing I'm not going to play is Congo Bongo because Congo Bongo I can play in Coleco. So, I figure, like, I mean, it's cool if they have a homebrew. They're going to have a homebrew for Atari, but, like, I'd rather place new stuff or, or the stuff that doesn't exist on other platforms. Oh, they did update the site with boxes. That's cool. Um, one of the games I got, which one of the homebrews I have, which I want to play at some point, is Baby Pac-Man for the 7800. Because Baby Pac-Man never had a home release on anything until until that that homebrew. So that's pretty cool. Whereas Congo Bongo, there's a whole bunch of Congo. Actually, I have Congo Bongo for DOS even. I'm probably gonna play Congo Bongo for DOS one time. 
Um, Always Asleep says, listen, just play Superman 64 for the N64 to completion, okay? I, I, I might do that at some point, but it's going to be a time when I really, like, feel like, like, I have to first, like, really supercharge on life and, like, have a really amazing day that everything goes my way and I get everything I want out of life. So then I can have, like, a lot of, you know, energy stored up when I get, like, it's soul, my soul crushed by Superman 64. We'll see about that. Anyway, before I play Superman 64 for the N64, I'm going to play Superman for the Atari 2600, which is another underrated game. I, I, I really enjoy it. It's, it's a very simple game, but I think it's very cool. We need 3 in three, the 2600. Bob's be Yeah, Bob, what's his name? Bob DeCrescendo or something like that? I guess he made a lot of... Uh, of Pac-Man homebrews for the 2600 and for the 7800. So, definitely very cool guy. Arena Foot says, what an Atari homebrew word from us. Who's us? Who do you represent, Arena Foot? I would like to know this. It's very interesting. Uh, yeah, no, I, I don't know for sure if, it is, if there's boxes or not. Um... I'm also trying to decide if I should play one more time. I had a good time. Don Draper says, what? Says, ooh, I can't remember the last time I saw the screensaver, so maybe I need to leave it. <laughs> uh, I, I, I think I'm like, my hand is all handed out for now. Superman 64, you're really going to give yourself an aneurysm. Translation, Stu will, Stu will play Superman 64 and pigs fly and speak Klingon. The real truth is, Stu will probably play Superman 64 when he's like 80, because... Before I get to N64 games, I gotta play, like, all the Atari games that I care about, which includes 2600, 5200, 7800, and Jaguar, if I can find anything good on the Jaguar, which I'm not sure about. All the television games I care about, all the ColecoVision games I care about, all the, like, other random systems, like, um, I played, excuse me, I played some Arcadia 2001... Astrocade, Vectrex, you know, stuff like that. And then I'm going to play all the Sega Master System games I care about, all the Sega Genesis games I care about, all the, the NES games, all the, N the the Super Nintendo games, and then maybe I'll get around to N64. i got plenty of other stuff to play before N64 comes around. So the chances of Superman 64 happening anytime in the, in the next five years is probably relatively low. Rita Foot says, the Atari Homebrew Brew Award Show with James O'Brien of Zero Page Homebrew Show. I sponsor the Atari. Oh, that's super cool. Do you want to do you want to shoot a link? Maybe put a, put a comment on the uh, the video with a link to that so some people can check it out, Arena Foot. I'd, lo I'd love to check it out. It's really cool. Uh, I, I don't I didn't know there's a Homebrew Awards show at all. I just I, mean, I go to the I go to the conventions and I see the the new the new uh you know uh, new homebrews they put out. And some of them look, you know, okay. And I, some of them look really good. I buy them right away. So I'm not sure about. And then I see other YouTubers play them and review them. And then I get excited about some of them and I play them that way. And I buy them because of that. I only bought that Roach in Space because when I played Ninja's Guy in Low Res World, which which was which is a great game, ex one of the best games ever made for the Atari for sure. Although of course back in the day it would have been pretty expensive. When I played that game, the the um, the developer, Vladimir, I forget his last name, joined the stream, and then he said, oh, I made this other game that has a physical copy called Roach in Space, so I bought that also. It's not as good as Ninja's Guy, frankly, but Ninja's Guy is a later game, so, you know, it is what it is. Um, Don Dreamer says, what? So it took my kid to the retro arcade today. Oh, awesome. Played some Miss... Where, 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 whereabouts are you? Are you in the U.S.? Which state? Miss Pac-Man, Elevator Action, 720, Robotron, Awesome. Or something cool with this. Hold on. This is 720 for the Commodore 64. And this is the European version. There were two versions of this made. One for the Commodore in the US, one for the Commodore in Europe. And the one in Europe comes on a cassette. And they couldn't actually get the music to be anywhere near as good as the arcade. So what they did was, and actually, the, even the graphics suck terribly. Look at this. Look at the back here. You'll see. Look at look at the, look at the graphics. But the gameplay supposedly is good. But what it says here is included in this pack is a recording of the music from the arcade coin-op machine. Play this in conjunction with your computer game and enjoy the action-packed realism of this exciting game. So because it's on a cassette tape, they were able to put the music on the tape too. So it's like 
forget the music from the game. Just play the tape. You'll hear the music from the arcade, and you can pretend you're playing the arcade game. <laughs> That's basically what it is. Oh, Game Vault, Morristown, New Jersey? I'm in Jersey. Morristown is only like an hour from me. Is that a good place? Have you been to um, either Billy's, what's it called? Billy's Arcade? Billy's Midway. It's, Billy's Midway, it's called. Have you been there? That's like probably halfway between me and, 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 and you. Uh, Turbo Graphics 16 PC Engine content now. Uh, yeah, that's not happening anytime soon either. Um, v, VHCZ Games are the homebrews you're talking about from AA, from Atari Age. Oh, VHCZ, is that, the, is that what it's called? Yeah, I need to visit. Yeah, it sounds like I do need to visit. Game Vault, I'll definitely check it out. It's pretty cool. So, um, anyway, folks, this has been really fun. I think... I mean, I hate to end the stream when we got a whole bunch of people on here, especially new people. But I think that's it for t for tonight. It's like twelve thirty here in, in New Jersey, as Don Japer says. What we'll tell you. So if you're new here, either you join the stream now or you watching this after the fact. And you're not subscribed to the channel. Please go ahead and subscribe. I do lots of stuff like this. It'll be lots of fun. I promise. If it's something you don't like, you can always skip it. But please subscribe to the channel. Please hit like if you like this. Yeah, it's in Hawthorne, exactly. I told you it's like halfway between me and you. So that, that gives you an idea of where I am. I'm, I'm in Bergen County. So we're, we're not, I'm pretty close, actually. No! Bye, guys! Wait, hold on. Don't leave yet! I want to say thanks to all you guys, especially Arena Foot. Arena Foot was the, was the guy who helped the most today. Thank you, Pirate Gear Boy 12, for always being here early. Thanks, Always Asleep. Thanks, Gamers Grotto, for being a great moderator today. Thanks, Dorian Cairn. Thanks, uh... Who else? I don't know if I should thank Huge Ass or not, but I will thank him anyway. Thanks, Huge Ass! <laughs> <laughs> and thank you, uh, the Bubs. I, I don't know where these guys came from, but uh, thanks for being here, I guess. And uh, thanks to everyone else who, who's, who's here, either before or after. Mark, I think, was here earlier and left. Thanks, folks, for watching this after the fact. We love uh, love interacting with the chat. That's the best part of playing these games. So if you guys like... Oh, Miami Sunrise here, too. Oh, man. Miami Sunrise, good to see you. I guess you were lurking. And even Hopster Key joined for... Said hello before. Hopster Key is like one of the earliest guys who joined, who, whoever was on this channel. So I always like it when he pops in and says hello. Uh, I got family in Hackensack. Oh, cool. Yeah, we're right we're right, right, right in your alley, Don Draper says what. I'll catch you on Facebook. Sounds good, Arena Foot. Uh, please ping me. And uh, thanks, guys. We'll do this again really soon. Have a great night, everybody. And uh, happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving this week. And we'll do some more streams later in the week. Peace out, everybody.